All right, guys. <laughs> Welcome back to Stuck Island. All of us stuck with you guys. We're always smiling. I don't even know why I'm smiling now. It's 6 a.m. Well, I'm smiling because I'm happy to be alive. That's the first thing. So 6 a.m. right now, and we are getting ready to go to Montego Bay to pick up one of my cousins, and then we're going to head to... S-O-N-R. <laughs> okay. Yo. Family in the, the building. Family is in the building. Yo. You see me? That's our big cousin, up, Gregory. Right? That's it, you see me? That's Don't know. We have Michelle. Yo. You see me? Yeah. Yo. Anything you see crab video, go on. She have to come in. Oi, oi. 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 Let's talk about crab virgin. Oh, my sister. <laughs> Oh, 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 I'm sorry, sorry. my bad, and that's my mom. Yeah, really? <laughs> <laughs> and of course, we have beans in here. Yeah. Already making tea. Already making tea because we left out so early this morning. So, making some Earl Grey tea. And thing again, so. Are you see the cup size? Yeah. <laughs> no, you see the cup size? Okay, okay. I like big things. I can't say the same thing. I can't say the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't say what I said. What? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Good girl, pack everything. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a nineties baby, it's a vibes. Yeah. Oh man. Uncle made this. Uncle wanted to make this one. Yes, sir. Oh, what is it? Banana bread. Um, what is it again? Okay, uh, okay. Ah, I could smell it. Yeah. Right, so my uncle is a chef, professional chef at that. He used to work for a chef. What that taste? Well, that is like, is that some of your cookers? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's the way it is. Of course. Yeah, so everybody is here. Um, my cousin came down all the way from New Jersey, isn't it? Because she is so excited to actually go on these so epic excited. trips that we have. Yes. <laughs> and my sister is hopping with us. Where we're going today is going to be. All right, while everyone is up there catching up or getting to know each other, I am here playing Bellman. I have the car packed and everything. So now we can get ready to go. So we are KFC right now, and Michelle is happy that she can finally get her barbecue wings. I am really like, is it me? I was so disappointed yesterday, so I am so excited. <laughs> <laughs> so, you don't know KFC is already certain things they can get, especially barbecue. So, we're having that right now. Me, Jilly, I think Sarah will get a party because we love um, the mother's party. Then. Sarah, Sarah don't want a party, what Sarah gets? I think food. Like, food, 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 Yo, no, it, it, it's me barbecue, say, it, it, like... The car smell up with the barbecue, oh. God! Oh, it's mine. Oh. <laughs> 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 but you see that box, me don't box. Me don't even want to eat oh. it. <laughs> me don't even want to eat it. So, Masa, which part of Jamaica you come from? <laughs> me have to ask you. <laughs> Portland, Portland, straight out of Portland. Straight out of Portland. <laughs> I can't give them a little announcement to sneak peek to what's going to yeah. happen. Yeah. Alright, we keep it funny. You right. see me? So, we don't know of the David over here, so. You yeah. see me? Versus Drizzy's team. Big, big cook off. Them said Bingy might have it in a boat. You know, so my bet is on you. Right. Yeah, you don't know anything. Yeah. Yes, Who is a cooker? Yeah. So, you know. Yeah. No, I'm a new girl, I'm right now. Oh, yeah, bro. You yeah, see yeah, me? Bro. Mix up, you yeah, cook? You yeah, go cook? <laughs> No, no sir, she'll she love jump off a cliff and then make it in yeah. the water. You think that? Did us quick stop by David, but we have a cut. But anyway, David's gonna be in a little competition with Drizzy Berg. He's in my cook off, so jump over to his channel, check it out. Yeah. And also Drizzy, so my money's on you, bro. You don't know, bro. <laughs> but... <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the cats out of the bag. We are in the beautiful the grill. Yo, while we're here, we definitely plan to like really explore the whole seven mile beach, you know, try to get some really amazing food. Michelle over there, Imani is over there, Sarah is over here. 
And also Beans is over here, you see me? So we are at our little family beach condo type of thing. Oh, you, see <laughs> you see me? So we have so much planned here. Yeah, we're going to be here for about three amazing days. So let's see how that goes. I don't know what the plan is for tonight. Possibly we might do the conk places I like going to. I think it's called Starlight Bar. Is it? Street light bar, that's exactly what it's called. So we'll go there because Michelle is a huge fan of seafood and I think they make one of the best conks. Oh, and they have, yeah, they normally have lobster on the menu, so that's gonna be like super amazing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited! <laughs> oh, yeah, the experience is oh, good so too. I'm ready, I'm ready, guys. Thank Trust you, <laughs> Oh yeah, and Sarah has never eaten from there. Well, three of them has never yeah. eaten from there before. You see me, so we're gonna go there and experience yeah, that. Man, want some seafood now. Okay, <laughs> and you said the food there was good, generally, good. right? Really, really nice. Really nice. And then I'm gonna have lobster now. So oh yeah, that's, that's gonna really make great. it like yeah. even better. Last time it was out there, they were also sweet. Yeah. So now... Wow. Michelle, you couldn't come to Jamaica and I'm gonna spot the apple tree. Next one, Here. avocado. Oh, whoa! And we have the breadfruit. Yeah, we have the mango. We have the little food. Yo! <laughs> <laughs> Listen, <laughs> two, two, two things Michelle now gonna miss. Michelle now gonna miss crab. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not. All right, so we're gonna head to the beach right now. So we are on the beach and it's blinding hot right now. I don't know, I never brought my, my glasses and thing. But yeah, we're on the Seven Mile Beach. There goes the boat guy that we're gonna use tomorrow to get all the way over there. Which is Booby Key. We're gonna take you guys on a really nice adventure over there. And you know, check it out. I could actually feel the water going on my throat. Yeah. You know, so I see the bag. I mean, I said, how can I, I will let them bag go with us off. Open the bag. Show them the prize. Oh my god. Apple. Hey, OTC. Good A glad bag. <laughs> Boss. <laughs> Dark for the better. Okay. Yes. This is the years. I yeah. haven't had one in really? really. Are you serious? What? I haven't oh, wow. been here like forever. This is the years. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> oh. yeah. Yeah. All right. So that was pretty cool to come back to our rooms and actually see the apples. Um, yes. Waiting. That was pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I like the hospitality there. We should. <laughs> Sarah, will you leave me in peace, please? It's not too nice. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> <laughs> so juicy. The yarn roll about the same enough. <laughs> wow, yo, Michelle definitely enjoy if you're so for the apple and everything like that. So yeah, we know that we're here. I know people always want to find out where we are. We're at the beach house condo. We are in the the lower jungle floor. I kind of like this spot a lot because it gives that kind of homely vibe. I wish it, I wish this room was closer to the beach, but of course, if you want to get that, you could cop it. During this time now, um, it's, what is this? August the 4th, so it's a day before a dream weekend. So during this period, it's kind of hard to get, to get rooms. We're lucky enough to get rooms right now because of the COVID period, because usually you would have not gotten anything at all. Anyway, so our agenda right now is to go to the supermarket to get some stuff to eat for breakfast and stuff you guys know when you travel it is pretty expensive um we're going to go to the booby key tomorrow to get some lobsters and stuff and just to give you guys a heads up it's set well no it's actually it's nine thousand dollars per person to go there and you usually get one lobster but i don't know so we kind of is it we have jilly panning team and jilly does work like a magic yeah. sprinkle like a magic dust yeah. and their things and you know <laughs> yeah so we're gonna head here tomorrow but anyway we're gonna go to the supermarket right now get some stuff and yeah, in the morning we can have breakfast. How does it feel being back on the road, Jilly? Great. <laughs> I'll tell you now, I'll see my tan line. 
it's time to oh my god yeah so keep record of what Jilly looks like right now because in a couple <laughs> hours she's not gonna be the same myself as well so for sure when I didn't stay there 14 empty and they care at a beer <laughs> <laughs> yeah thanks all right so there's a market right now where I get some beer and get some other stuff from the supermarket you never wait you never had sour beer before you never have a sour beer yet yes I did oh okay Now we here gradually. I take it time full up. Let's play the guest game. Drop another comment and tell me how much you think in that basket. How much you feel it is? Yeah. Over ten thousand. I say, I say, I say, fifteen thousand dollar. That's like a hundred dollars. I would say. All right. So we added more stuff. It's definitely past the hundred dollar mark. It's probably at now. 150, it's about 20,000 Jamaican, I would, I would suppose. Yeah. yeah and then Them are two skeetos and dip, so. 30 it's, grand. It's like 25 <laughs> grand. Oh, hold on. I changed it. You said 19,000? No, I said 20, because of the round. 20,000? 20, 20, what do you say? 25,000 and $1. <laughs> I said 25,000, what do you say? 25. 25. In, in the US, something like this amount, like how much it would cost? Uh, Hundred and something dollars. Right Hundred and some dollars? Yeah, yeah. Roughly. How much you say, sir? Twenty eight. Twenty eight thousand? Yeah. I hope you're wrong. <laughs> <laughs> So the winner is over there, Sarah with 28,000 and the losers have to pack up the gross weight. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so these are some that we got. We got some basic stuff, you know, just juice, um, some stuff to eat um, for breakfast. I don't know, Sangsta, some rum after there. Um, Sarah beer, Sarah beer has to be there. Don't know me, love my Malta. And yeah, that's basically um, that. So that's a, a huge part of traveling. You don't know, getting groceries and whatever. So like I said, um, the next step is to go tonight to that um, seafood spot. We might have to leave pretty early because curfew at the moment here is 8 p.m. Um, in the evening. So I think it would be safe if we leave out like maybe like 5.30. If I can call ahead, I will call ahead and I'll drop the number in the description box so you guys can reach out to them just to find out what is the operation time and when you can go there to grab your dinner. <laughs> then take a picture of everybody else about the bus driver. She <laughs> <laughs> call it Crocs. <laughs> Sorry, Crocs. <laughs> yeah, so it started raining here, but anyway, we're heading to where we need to get to. Um, that street lights bar and grill, one of my favorite street food spots. And today, I think this whole new grill trip is gonna be all about the lobster. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the Oh, yeah. Yeah, the Yeah, the Yeah, the Yeah, the Yeah, the Yeah, Yeah, the Yeah, the Yeah, the Yeah, the Yeah, Yeah, the Yeah, Yeah, the Yeah, I will forever be coming back down there, so. Nice. Beans, you know? Yeah, bless up. Yo. Oh, that's always up.
Just meet up with Alvin a while ago at my favorite seafood spot inside of Savalamar. How the food is? Bless you. The food is good. What do you, what, what you order? Um, conk and roti. Conk and roti. I love the roti down here. Yeah, man. Turn right it up. Right Why you say food eat, mama? Food eat good? Food good, man. I tell you, say the food nice and yes, man. <laughs> 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 what? It's right in the beer. So the owner just passed through all the girls and I say, oh, I'm going to make you try some crab. Is it me? I say, and I'm sure I can get my share. Let me tell you, if you don't believe me, the affirmation, please. Yeah. Listen, I, I said it and I can take it off. I'm, I'm good. <laughs> Thank you. That's a real life affirmation for you, because <laughs> it's like the crab gods them just. Don't need to. Yeah. 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 I want to get the reaction, but <laughs> this. Oh, 
taste the meat yet. Oh. Nice. Oh my god. West side of the best side. Oh, you bet. I know. Well, I know. And the girl is not a nice dog. You can't go to Cheers. It's a joy to meet you, you're so beautiful. Mojo. 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 She was serious. You made a brand 
Bakit? 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 Bless up. It says thanks, Steven. <laughs> it's so happy. <laughs> Not even me, the belly. <laughs> Yo, Michelle, well up in my crack. Take it to the crumb. This is con juice. Oh. <laughs> Argument done. <laughs> done. <laughs> it was a vibe tonight. So Yo, yeah. trust me. Epic, 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 epic. It was epic, a epic. toy good vibe. <laughs> it was good. Yo, shout out to Joe. I'm talk to you like Joe make tonight be like a super amazing light. Like, if we're supposed to be honest, Yo, so just a little quick backstory. What happened was like we were just there talking. Everybody was talking, having a great time. And of course, Joe, I talked to the four ladies them. And me being the only man there, don't know me, just kind of ignore everything I met the man put in him work. You understand? And at one point, you know, just listening to him, even though it on them juice, I was like, yo, that boss have a really big vocabulary still, you know. So like, he must say, yo, why dog I say? Is it me? And if I'm supposed to be honest at that very moment, I was like, yo, Jano, like, I hope the man not feel like I was trying to be rude or whatever. And then I turned around. And then when I turned around, he was just like, yo, Jano. <laughs> and I was just like, here is going to be a case of mistaken identity. This is where everything just goes downhill. <laughs> you see me? But then, you know, he realized that it was from the channel and whatever the case is. And for me, it was a really humbling experience because, you know, people like that who show respect to the craft that you're trying to do, you know, whether it's, you know, really understanding your roots, you know, exploring the hidden places in Jamaica or just showing patronage to the restaurants that we see, you know, on the channel all the time, you know, because trust me, the business does help them, especially in the COVID times. But that restaurant in particular, I don't think anything can stop it because the food there is so good. For those who are interested in the bill, for all of us, for the drinks that we had tonight and all of the lobster, the fish, the conch, it was 9,800 Jamaican dollars, which to me is ridiculously affordable based on the experience and just the overall taste of the food. I think everybody can agree, say, oh, you see me? And it's a place that I will take anybody because they will never let you down. Like the food is consistent. And I think the best part about it, the nicest touch was that, you know, he offered some crab. And right now, Michelle, I got at the crab with little and no mercy. <laughs> you see me? So, <laughs> and stuff like that for me is a pleasure, you know, being able to, cause, you know, Michelle is my cousin. You see me? And she watched the channel and everything like that and I always wanted to be a part of that whole side of life experience. So thank you so much um, Streetlight Bar and Grill for making that possible with the food tonight. And um, yeah, we're going to end tonight's video and um, shout out to everybody who dropped a like on the video because it does help or for those who dropped a comment. And remember three things. Love. Come guys. Come with me. I'm enjoying you. How's the crab? And remember these three things, love, nature, adaptation, and always remember to keep the link.